Yes, lads, and welcome to season four. Season four. But before we get into season four, we have to go to the Euro Championship. But before we get into the Euros, it's time to put some people up on the transfer list. And the first one is Bauman. He's amazing. He is a leader of men. But he's 33 and 84 rated. I think it's best to just get the money while I can. And the other two to go on the transfer list are Ak Akipogma and Adams Nuhu. They're just not going to play at all. Kadrabek is another one that we'll, we will be saying goodbye to. But it was a fun time while it lasted. Darun is another man who will go next season. Because he's terrible, <laughs> to be honest. Same with Ricky Puig. He's not terrible, but he's just not good enough for the Bundesliga and for the Champions League. Tammy Abraham is going next season when I can add him to the transfer list. He's been good, but he's just not been that striker, that finishing striker that I need. That like quick little pacey striker that just scores everything that comes to him. He's just a little bit too clunky for me. And this is the first transfer offer coming in for Bauman. 11.9 million, I'm just going to accept. Bauman, it has been an honour. You have saved me so, 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 so many times. But it's time to say goodbye to the most coveted German keeper in Hoffenheim history. Goodbye, Bauman. Here is another transfer offer for another player I'm going to be selling, Kaderobek. But this time, I'm going to negotiate for some more money. There we go, 23 million for Kaderobek. Pavel Kaderobek. He's been a great little right back, but it's time to move on. So 32, uh, 23 million for Kadrobek will do. So as we're in the Euros group stage, I won't show you the results, but at the end of it, I'll just show you where we finished in the group stage. But here we go. Have I been sacked? No, I have not been sacked. Come on, it's another season at Hoffenheim. Let's go, lads. And that is the group stage standings. We have completely wiped the floor in this group. We won every single game. And we have got 127, pretty much 128 million to spend. And that's without even selling Darun and Tammy Abraham. And a transfer offer for Ricky Puig has come in from, from Levante for 35 million. I'm going to try to get 40. And 40 million is enough. Ricky Puig, goodbye. But thank you for the 40 million, Levante. And our first round of the season is to be Darwin Nunes from Everton. Leipzig are currently trying to buy him, so we're going to steal him. So it's time to negotiate new Nunes's contract. I bought him for 43 million. Well, I'm going to buy him for 43 million if he accepts his contract, which hopefully he should. Wage 45k a week. That is perfect. Welcome to the, to the club, Darwin Nunes. And I have found Lorenzo Insigne is a free agent, and I think it's perfect to sign him. And welcome to the club on a two-year deal, Lorenzo Insigne. There has been a transfer offer for Tammy Abraham, but it's a swap deal. So I'm going to negotiate and try to just get about 110 million for Abraham. 100 mil, are they going to take it? 40 mil plus Koke. No, because Koke is about 42 years old. 80 million for Tammy Abraham. There we go. Tammy, it's been a good two seasons, but I'll take 80 mil any day of the week. And in the semi-final of the Euros, we play Belgium. This is the start in 11. And we beat Belgium. Into the final of the Euros we go. I won't be playing it, just because this is a transfer window special. But hopefully we can win the final. And in the final of the Euros, we are against France. Who else would it be? But we win anyway. We are the Euros winners. Come on. That's two trophies in like three months for me. It's coming home. <laughs> and our two next transfers are going to be big. First of all, Gregor Kerbel. This is going to be a massive signing. First of all, I'm going to try 60 million. And they want 87. Whew, that's a lot of money. I'm going to go down to 75. Because 87 mil, that's a lot of money for a keeper. 75 million. There we go. Perfect. 63k a week. That is perfect. Welcome to the club, the new starting 11 keeper, Gregor Kerbel. And Abraham has just sold, so we now have 124 million to spend on a centre mid. Maybe a centre mid and a CDM. Probably that. And the centre mid slash CDM we're going to try to go for is Bissouma. First of all, I'm going to try 52 million. I'm not really sure how much he'll actually be worth. 36 mil plus Insigne. No, 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 no. So I'm going to try 60 million then. 
and see what they say about that. 60.9, because I can't be bothered to change it. There we go, 60.9 million. That's perfect. 68k a week. They're taking some good pay cuts to join my club. Welcome to the club, the new CDM vs Basuma. I don't know how to say his last name, or his first name, I mean, but I tried. And the last signing for now is going to be Danny Carvajal. 33 million? Are they taking it? They're taking it. Let's go. The, the wage is going to be a problem here. <laughs> There's going to be a fat old wage for Carvajal. There's no way he's taking a massive pay cut to join this club. 100k, I'll take that. Welcome to the club, the new right back for like a season or two, Daniel Carvajal. And the last two signings of this transfer window will be Nadiem Omeri on a free contract. We're taking advantage of these free agents this time. Rotation player, that is perfect. Two years. I'd rather want three just to take him to 30. No release clause. And the wage will be... I'm going to try 20k and see what he says. 30k, that's fine. Welcome to the club, Amiri. So that is the team after this transfer window. Well, most of the transfer window. Half, this, half the transfer window we've still got left. But I don't think we're going to make any more signings. This looks like a team that can get deep into the Champions League, I'll tell you that. And I'm the manager of England for another six months or whatever the contract has said. <laughs> so as we are now at the Super Cup against Bayern Munich, I'm going to end this video here. This video was just a transfer window special, slash a little bit of a Euros Championship special, you know. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching this episode. Look at that starting team. That's going to win a Champions League in about two seasons. And I'll see you all next time when we get into the games for Season 4.